fan, find the man doing work in the early mornings. <laughs> Can't show what he's just shredding personal documents apparently. Where did oh, did you go through that whole thing on my desk? Go through that cubby. Wow. You just get a little streak in you? Um I've been paying bills and working on tax prep. Okay. There's a few things we need to get. Still. And okay. I had the accountant. Alright, I haven't really done my hair yet. But hello. We're gonna start our day here. Me doing my rounds. Picking up messes. Left over from when I go to bed at nine o'clock at night. <laughs> Ugh. How many blankets do you think we need down here? When this fire is always on, it's always on. I need it to be turned off. It's not cold in here. But how are you guys doing today? Um, I'm not getting ready a ton today because I want to clean out my car and run to the grocery store. Basically, I just don't really need to get ready for the day <laughs> beyond my eyes. And I'm going to do twisties in my hair. I don't want to like do my hair for today and tomorrow just to have to wash it again for church. So, you know, I'm a planner even for my hair. <laughs> um, yeah, that's basically, um, we're the only ones up, I think. Chelsea's probably awake, but in bed. And Jason's doing that to go through tax documents as well. We're just gonna get some few, a few of these things done around the house and then figure out what else to do next. All right, we went ahead and did Ashley's dishes for her. But I am gonna have her clean these pans from Abby's Cookies that she made yesterday. Have her clean those by hand. And someone put peanut butter in a cup. Probably for apples, but <laughs> peanut butter doesn't come out. So there, she's gonna hand wash these. But I went to put something away. And I don't know why I'm the only one in this whole family who knows how to put anything away in this pantry. And yes, the floors, yeah, they need to be cleaned. <laughs> So that's Abby's job. But like, let's just, sure, let's just stick that on the shelf or we could put them away. We could just stick them on the shelf or we could put them away. We could stick it on the shelf or we could put it away. Like, <laughs> I'm the only one who knows how to do this. Or willing, it's really annoying, but mama can't find any pasta sauce. I wonder why, because it doesn't belong by the cereal buckets. So I'm not going to deep dive into this. I'm just going to put things where they belong, throw things out if they're garbage, and we'll just show people where things actually can get put. I know I shouldn't do this, but it drives me nuts. Okay, took me 10 minutes, not even 10 minutes. Uh, these, if they get left open here in Washington, they're stale. So someone didn't close that. Don't even need to try it. It's going to be stale. This is all recycle and very simple. If we just put things where they go. Cereal. Cereal buckets. Pasta. Pasta bucket. In fact, we could go to the garage and get three more boxes of pasta and fill that up along with a different kind, which I'm going to go and do. Um, these cereals, th this one needs to be made into Muddy Buddies. They won't eat Chex plain. And they need to use this one to make some Rice Krispie Treats. Because they won't eat, they won't eat these plain. And they need to remember that we have these. I would fill this up with the other um, goldfish I have in the garage. But given they haven't eaten these quite yet, I'm just going to have them finish that. Same with the pretzels. I have refills on all those, but these need to get eaten first. Um... The next row, these are all good chips. They're just the last of the bag. I don't know what it is about the last of the bag, but children don't like to eat them. But I'm not throwing them away because they're all good because we've been using our chip clips to keep those fresh, 
I've got pastas and soups that don't fit into these containers. I wish these ones fit, but they don't. I should just buy a new, an actual like, I mean, this is a soup dispenser, but I need to get one um, that is bigger so I can go across the shelf a little bit more, but pretty simple. It just helps if you put things away where they go. Next up, we just washed Chelsea's cooling blanket, but it doesn't go in the dryer. So we're just gonna dry that off, um, air, air dry it off, but I'm not gonna turn that fireplace on because we've got a lot of warmth coming from the sun. <gasps> oh, I thought you were at Ashley. <laughs> it's Abby, come on down. Okay, next up is a little uh, secret I don't like to admit to, but also, we aren't saving those. He is the worst at throwing things away. I spent a crap ton on those balloons. Jason, you can't reinflate those. There's two of them up there that are like uninflated. There's no point. Peace, peace. Inside, I said, hey, hun, can you turn off your podcast? And take off your headphones. Why is my phone not registering in the car? Come on. Um, and come out and help me vacuum out my car. Come on. It's like now it's like recording me. <laughs> um, and I was like, and it's sunny enough that we could actually wash our cars. He didn't respond. He didn't have his headphones in. He didn't respond to me, okay? Then I come out here and, I'm gonna put you on the top of the car. I come out here and he literally walked out here and he's like, oh, it's sunny enough out here. I think we could wash our cars. I was like, oh, I love that that's your idea. Epitome of our life. Yeah, I'm standing here with the same phone. You guys just saw that. I took it out of my car, or out of my pocket. Okay, this is hard for me to admit, but this is not my mess. This is not my mess. Not even the fries are my mess, because the fries are not by my seat. Okay, here is the secret. Now, this is my sweatshirt right here. I had that one taken off yesterday. But the rest of this is just one of my children that happens to be, always be in my car. Spot the fries down on the floor. I don't sit over here. There's no way I could make that mess. So it's time to clean it out and show her what it's supposed to look like. I also added my garbage bag that I got online to her handle i know it looks dumb right there when jason's in the passenger seat with me it might be in his way but this is her vow to do better with her trash when she's sitting in the front seat with me so we are going to vacuum the floors and then i'm going to wipe all the seats down with just a what are the what is that microfiber towel wet microfiber towel sure. um but we're gonna. Clothes inside or what? Yeah, it all comes inside. Are you kidding me? This is ridiculous. I know it. There's like a whole closet out here. I know. All right, that is the mess. Need to pull that out, but it covers this little tray. These are the ones that I bought separate from the car. The only stuff on there right now is from when we pulled this out, and some just kind of went onto the floor. So this does a really good job at keeping the carpet down there clean. But I want to carefully pull this out. Guess how many umbrellas are in the car? Well, I found, I don't know, go look in the front seat. Can you go look in the front seat and see how many you found in the front? Well, someone, I thought someone took my umbrella. There's one, two, three. Right? Found one under the seat. Okay, then I'm, I'm vacuuming out back here. What do you got? And there's a repel bottle that I... Bye, Abby. Bye, Abby. What's that? It's a Brenner umbrella. Oh, that's the one I got you because you're talking about needing an umbrella. You didn't buy this. No, I didn't buy it. I had got it from the store. Clark's. Yes. I thought it was a Tesla umbrella. No. I was all excited that Tesla gave me one. No, no, not as exciting. It's you, just you just Clark's. got me free merch from your vendors. <laughs> yeah, because you said you needed one. I do. Now I have four. And I might hog them all. My kids are my thieves with my umbrella.
what you feel I don't even know if this is real How can you like me? You're as close to perfect as anyone can be You and me, you and me We don't need no one else than each other You and me, you and me all right, apparently the declutter bug has been caught and Kaylee <laughs> has decided to clean out her room. She is going through everything in order to what move out. This? That's my question. It's a, I don't know what that is, but she's got all of her things from her closet. She's just taking everything out. I'm taking her perfume. No, you're not. You're she's she's not dying. She like she. No, they're acting like I'm dying. I know. Yeah. But she on. is organizing it um, so that she can put away her memorabilia, like her yearbooks. Um, like she has a bunch of paintings um, that she's either keeping or giving to Chelsea. Correct. Yeah. And that you can just that's trash. You can throw that away. It's not so we're gonna make. You she's gonna make piles. Ow. She's having her sisters help her Ow. make piles. That, yeah, that got you. Um, Jason's finishing up his car. I lost steam when it got to his car. And so he's finishing up, and then we're going to run errands. Um, we're not going to tell that I'm buying you a bin because he wants you to use one from the garage. <laughs> okay. But I want her to have a nice new bin see-through to put her mem like her yearbooks and stuff in. Um, things that she is not taking away to college and then I'm going to store it here in the house instead of in the garage so that it doesn't get damaged and dusty and all that kind of stuff. So, um, anyway, so I, this is overwhelming, but I have taught my kids how to do this. So trust the process, taught them well. Okay, we got a few things. We got a lot of snacks. Actually, I got plain. <laughs> I got plain snacks, gum, snacks for the kids today, just for fun because they're being good kids. Ranch, peanut butter, a couple of those, ham, and Fair Life. And then we got this bin for Kaylee. She's still working hard at home, so we're gonna get her that bin to put all her memorabilia in. Okay, these girls. I'm gonna show you all the progress. Me, but, but this is Kaylee's homecoming dress. The worst decision of my life. Yeah, well, this fabric sucks. It, like, was it? Were you a sophomore or junior? This I was went to all of them. So freshman. I know, but you didn't wear this one in your senior year, did you? This was freshman year. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Like this is like a girls' dance one, like before Jacob was along. Okay. Do you want to take the? Well, I'll go and show. You guys have made a lot of progress today. Yeah. So I did get you snacks while I was out. Let's go. Oh, okay. Here. She's passionate. Okay, hurry, take it. Take one. Take one. Take one. There you go. All right, they're still going up here. So I'm going to show you what they're doing. Jacob's playing video games. Is Ashley playing with you now, Jacob? Yeah, I'm having Ashley drive. Okay. <laughs> He's getting a little bored because they're just still on a kick. Yeah. Wow. This was cleaned out. And now it's closed. But... Did you put your bin in there? Mom, do you like my driveway? <laughs> well, I... It scares me. <laughs> I believe you. So, Kaylee's got all of her clothes from her closet out here. Yeah. Correct? And she's going through everything to declutter. Okay, okay battery died. Also, we got a Shein haul. <laughs> I will show you... Um, it was partial birthday stuff and then Kaylee got all of her clothes didn't fit <laughs> and so I got had to replace two swimsuits and a skirt and a t-shirt because we all got the wrong sizes last time so nothing new for her and then I got three things for Chelsea's birthday one thing for Ashley's birthday so I can't show you and then a whole bunch of travel stuff I'm gonna do a travel video later on but this is what Kaylee well you can't see it hang on this is what Kaylee condensed all of her like memorabilia down to. She's gonna wrap those up. She made all those in ceramics. And then this bin here just has all her yearbooks and whatnot. So we're gonna store those in here. 
they could probably get tucked back into the corner, but this is the man cave, if you can't tell. I came out here and I thought they were playing Dora the Explorer, but it's, what is it, Jacob? Viva Pinata. Pinata. I'm kind of hoping that's the get rid of pile over there. No, I'm thinking that's a cold, isn't it? I guess it is a good sweater. Okay, you're still working. Oh, that's underwear. All right, I'm gonna show you, can I show them your room? And how clean it out, cleaned out it is? I think it's a good thing that Abby was at work today <laughs> during all of this. She's, she loves a good declutter, but when someone else is doing it, it kind of stresses her out. So this is Kaylee's closet, but she has this whole thing cleared off. This is all stuff you're keeping, needing to use now, and then taking to school, right? All that stuff up there, right? And then she's cleared this off down to a few things that she'll take with her, including here. Are you taking the tower? Yeah, it's including the uh, puzzle. Yeah. Oh, and the puzzle, yeah. The puzzle painting, So, or the puzzle artwork, or whatever. Here's the shirt that I was talking about. Oh, for yeah, that's a good one for family photos. Yeah, we're just doing neutrals. I need to make that appointment. Okay, then Chelsea worked really hard in this room and got it all cleaned out, and she vacuumed every little corner. It does look like Ashley <laughs> didn't do much, but she kind of tore her bed apart. Um, I don't know why. I think maybe she's washing some pillowcases and some blankets, so her bed just needs to be made. She got a purse from Kaylee. I think she just doesn't know where to put that and doesn't know how to hang up any of her clothes. Even though she has a really easy closet that is not, you know, it is not too cluttered. I don't understand. Well, we just shut that. We just, we just shut that, right, Chels? Yes. But your room does look very nice. And we stopped off and got her some acrylic paint on our way home from Target. Yeah, I was going to get like the regular one and I was like, no, not with the amount of painting Chelsea does. And she got all these canvases from Kaylee and got permission to paint over them. So she's just doing a white coat over all of them. And then you have a whole new set of canvases. We both deserved to rest and relax tonight. Yeah, quite productive. This is the bag Kaylee gathered up from her clothes, from her closet. I think that was good for her to purge before she moves out. And it adds to our pile. You want to see our pile so far? Okay. Oh, now I'm just going to show you from up here. <laughs> it's so big. Usually we can't actually fit the recycling can in here because the pile is so big. I don't know how we're gonna get this all to the place where we have to load it into the U-Haul that we're gonna rent, or a, um, what's it called, Home Depot truck. But that is our haul for Ashley's fundraiser so far. But we are gonna sign off tonight. Just wanna show you this. <laughs> Jason's dad is cute. He finds out what things make Abby happy or the other kids happy if, you know, he just kind of takes turns. He got all of them ice cream the other day and then he, I told him, I said, Abby's back to baking. She's, she's feeling better. And so he went and got her, her favorite brownie mix from Costco. And I love that her grandpa's just, they just take care of her in their own ways. Pretty sweet. So she'll find, I'm sure she saw this before she went to work, but she's still at work. So, all right, we're going to sign off, correct? Adios. Oh, yes, I mean, I. Japanese for what? Uh, the first was Spanish. Yeah, I know. Then it was Japanese for good night. He's uh, utilizing both of his du duolingos. That's right. Correct? That's right. And you are utilizing the last couple weeks of Paramount, Paramount, trial, Paramount trial, trial period. I'm liking Halo, <laughs> and this is the Star Trek Discovering the World something. Yeah. Captain Pike. Yep. We have it till, I think it's like March 17th or something like that. Wait, wait, March 17th? You said the end of the month. Oh, I don't know what it is. I have, no, it's on here. It's already canceled, but it had already like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I figured it was worth whatever. I think it was like 10 bucks or something. Because we needed it to make sure we could watch the Super Bowl. Yeah, I know. Because we had to see Taylor Swift. <laughs> it was a good game. It was a good we game. We haven't been able to like... I like watching it football. Was a good game. It was a I good like game. watching football. I like being excited about a team. It but was... there's no other team that I had ever cared about watching. I, I, Fair I, enough? Yeah, I mean... I, right. I just rooted for the Chiefs because 49ers are kind of rivals to the Seahawks. Yeah. There's a little rivalry. So I thought, well, you know, let's not root for them. And we have a friend who is like diehard 49ers. So we've always been against the 49ers. Yeah. I respect them. I respect them. Yeah, team, like whatever. Yeah. 
but we haven't ever wanted to like, you know, watch the Super Bowl when the Seahawks aren't in the Super Bowl, which has only been once. So we wanted to make sure we got that and then the subscription rolled for a month. So he's just been utilizing that every single night. And you wanna say goodnight to everyone? This girl and Chelsea, you worked really hard today for your sister. Yeah, cause we just stole her clothes. Come down here. This is hers. Are you barely dressed? No, I took this top. You look like you have underwear on. Pull them down. Oh, is this that her is top? Yeah, it's shop. I had to tie it a That's little. That's really cute. But it's silly. It is cute. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to say goodnight. You did a good job. Thank you for all your hard work. You're, you're, you need, you need to go and zip fire. up your bed. <laughs> She's learned that tactic from her father. What? When she doesn't want to do something, doesn't want to lie, doesn't want to like own <laughs> up to it, just like her dad, she goes stone silent. Am I wrong? Stone silent. Shush. <laughs> Good night, guys. Take care.